Hey guys, you're right. This is Blood Boy Game. We're just coming to you with a quick tutorial today on Sony Vegas Pro 11 rendering settings, just the basics. Um, first of all, obviously you need to download the whole new Vegas Pro 11. And to do this, a great website or a great press I found who does tutorials on this is Josh 321's channel. And um, his channel's here. Um, literally, if you type it in, his name in, it'll come up. Um, yeah, I find it great for the tutorials, step by step instructions. I had to download it for free. Um, all right, carrying on with this. Basically, um, this is my clip here. What you want to do? Just import a clip, which is used for this button here. Um, then just cut it down to size. Get your clip, and uh, this is the clip. Uh, this is just a really standard clip guys, just, well, just a nice little triple there. And um, basically, all you want to do, you want to cl right click on this, on the clip, go down to properties, and you want to make sure disable resample is ticked. Uh, I have no idea why this is, but it seems to work, so it's probably best to do it. Also, if you have a look on the video up here, on the top right, top and the right hand side of the video, it's a black line, lining. Um, most people like to get rid of this because it just looks a tiny bit unprofessional on YouTube. Um, so to get rid of this, you just go to Video Event Pan and Crop, and you literally get this down the corner and just slide it in the tiniest amount. You can see it over here if it looks good enough. That looks fine. It just zooms in a little bit, and you literally just click the red cross. Um, now getting on to rendering. You want to highlight your clip or your clip area and go to render as. Okay, what you want to do now is you want to browse for the folder you want to save it into. For this clip, I'm going to save it into COD Modern Warfare 2 and just save it here. I'm going to save it as Tasty Triple. You just click save, It'll come up there. Now, what you want to do is for me, I find WMV files work the best because I can view them in Windows Media Player and then when I upload them to YouTube they seem to work really nicely so always well, my tip would be always use WMV files you may have to I don't know but that's what my tip is um, you then go down to 6 MBPS HD 720 just click on that and just go customize template from here what you want to do you want to have a look at audio, I tend to keep this the same guys, firstly because it works, secondly because I don't have a clue about all this like here. So um, what I do, CBR, Windows Media Audio 9.2, and then I keep it the same, but again if you're more advanced or know a lot more than me about sounds or audio, then just change this, but as a standard basic tutorial, this would do nicely. Uh, down here in the lower tabs, just click video. Um, this one, okay. Uh, it's usually all set up for you. CBR, you want to keep CBR. You want to keep Windows Media Video 9. You also want to make sure that it's high definition, 128 by 720. Um, if it's not, just literally just click it. <laughs> um, then you want to ensure the pixel aspect ratio is on 1. Uh, what I do with the frame rate here is I put it down to 25. Um, this is because I literally saw a video on on Sony Vegas 10, and they put it down to 25 PAL. So ever since then I've done it, but it really it works nicely, and quality comes out fine. Um, then obviously you want your video smoothness to be right at its sharpest, so move that up to 100% or 100. Um, that's basically that bit done. Bit right, it should come up with this. Um, but you just tick the box if it's not internet LAN and just write in 6M. Uh, index summary, you don't do anything to. Project then. Um, this bit's important because obviously you want your quality to be the best it can be. So literally click on the arrow here and just go down to best. Um, you don't need to really change this unless, again, you're good at all the. I don't know, you're advanced, shall I say. This is just a basic tutorial. Um, and that's that's literally it, guys. Um, 
to save your template, you just want to save a template, it makes it a lot easier, obviously. And if you save as YouTube template, then just literally click save. Uh, I've got to write that, but yeah. Um, then you just click OK. That should be there. The name of your clip, and then you literally just render it, guys. Um, I'm Black at Work Gaming, and uh, this has just been a quick tutorial on Vegas Pro 11 rendering settings. Um, just a quick shout out to my mate Juggernaut. Uh, he's got a competitive channel. Uh, some really nice clips there, guys. Uh, competitive 1v3s, 1v4s. Just check him out. Um, you know, and subscription for him would be great. I'm sure he'll really appreciate that. Another one's in touch channel. He's got FIFA and uh, game battles and Desero and COD. Um, it's real upcoming stuff here, guys, with all these uh, channels. But again, just subscribe, like some of his videos. If not, if you don't like them, well, that's fine. But um, yeah, just have a check it out, guys. Then obviously my channel here. I'm just doing a bit of FIFA. Got some COD coming up, as you can see. And um, so any subscriptions, likes would be absolutely appreciated, 100%. But um, anyway, thanks for your time. I hope this video helps you. And um, thanks for watching, guys.